greenhouse chemistry. The reaction of four metals with vinegar. We have aluminium, zinc, iron and magnesium. Let's have a look at the reaction of the four metals with vinegar. First the aluminium. It's floating on the surface, let's give it a shake. Nothing much appears to be happening yet. What about the zinc? Here goes the zinc. Well again, not much initially, but we need to leave them both to react for some time. Here goes the iron. We've got a little screw and a nail here. And finally, the magnesium. Well, an instant re reaction from the magnesium there, which you can say bubbling and uh, bobbing up and down at least one of the pieces. So magnesium, most reactive initially. We can, of course, test the gas given off by the magnesium with a lighted splint. First we need to trap it. Need to wait for a sufficient quantity to test. Very small scale here, but we're hopeful for a positive test. We will be testing with a lit splint or burning splint. Let's give that a go. So here's a splint and a positive little test there, confirming hydrogen is produced when magnesium reacts with vinegar. The three others are not showing sufficient signs of reaction. It may be something off the zinc there, very slow evolution of bubbles, don't think you'll pick that up on camera. So we need to come back to those and have another look in a while. Well here are our four metals having reacted for about five to ten minutes with the ethanoic acid and really not much of a change. The magnesium still bubbling rapidly but the iron, zinc and aluminium not showing much at all. If anything it's the zinc that is showing very, very small bubbles, but without a close-up, you won't be able to detect those, I think. So we need to leave the reactions going for rather more time. 